Heartache. Although in emotion, it hurts. The thought of standing in a corner as every other guy shares a laugh with a woman while you just wait for your turn, only to walk home alone, is just too much to bear. The idea that no woman wants your time, doesn't want to hold your hand. This notion that you might die alone breaks a man's soul. And you probably felt it at least once in your life. Why don't I deserve to be happy, you might think to yourself. Well, you do. You are not invisible, so to speak. You, roughly said, are merely uninteresting. Yeah, it's pretty simple. Interest stems from not only how you look, but how you behave. The truth is, there are ways to get any girl's attention that are scientifically proven. It's not about being the most attractive or the most charming. Well, I am interesting. You, you might be, but not to a stranger. So what does this mean? Well, in this video, we're going to see the necessary steps to transcend from being a wall to a door of new relationships. Are you ready to begin? Well, let's begin then. To understand the art of seduction, one must first understand its history. For centuries, men have been trying to woo women with various tactics and strategies. Some have been successful, while others have absolutely failed miserably. The art of seduction is like a dance. It takes two people, two partners, to create something beautiful. But most men don't know how to dance. They stumble, they step on toes, and they end up alone on the dance floor. Similarly, when it comes to seduction, most men lack the knowledge and skills to succeed. They make common mistakes, such as coming on too strong, being too passive, or not reading the signals that women give off. This has led to a crisis of masculinity, where men feel lost and uncertain of how to navigate the complex world of dating and relationships. But it doesn't have to be that way. By learning the scientifically proven tricks to get any girl's attention, men can improve their chances of success and regain their confidence. Own the room around you. To get a girl's attention, you need to stand out from the crowd. But that doesn't mean you need to do something outrageous or over the top. Instead, you need to own the room around you. What does this mean? It means being confident in yourself and your surroundings. It means holding your head up high, standing up straight, and walking with purpose. It means being the guy that everyone wants to talk to because he just exudes confidence and charisma. By owning the room, you'll allow her to notice you without even having to approach her. It sets you apart from the other guys who are too nervous or too shy to command attention. And it's a powerful way to make a lasting first impression. Think about it. When you walk into a room, do you want to be the guy who slinks into the corner and hopes no one notices him? Or do you want to be the guy who walks in and instantly commands attention? The answer is obvious. So, stand tall, take up space, and own the room around you. It's the first step in getting a girl's attention. Make and don't break eye contact without approaching her. Eye contact is one of the most powerful forms of nonverbal communication. When you make eye contact with someone, it shows that you are confident, you're interested, and you're engaged. But it's not just about making eye contact. It's also about not breaking it. When you break eye contact, it shows that you're nervous or not confident. It can also make you seem uninterested or distracted. So when you're in a room with a girl that you're interested in, Make eye contact with her and don't break it. Unless you absolutely have to, obviously. This will show her that you're confident and interested. And it'll make you stand out from the other guys who are too nervous to make eye contact. But here's the catch. Don't approach her just yet. Instead, hold the eye contact and let that tension build. Let her wonder who you are and why you're looking at her. This is a powerful way to pique her interest and make her know that you're interested and she's gonna want more. Act uninterested. It probably seems counterintuitive, but acting uninterested can actually be a very powerful way to get a girl's attention. When you act uninterested, it shows that you're not needy or desperate. It also makes her wonder why you're not giving her attention that she's used to getting from other guys. But there's a fine line between acting uninterested and being a jerk. You don't want to completely ignore her or be rude. Instead, you want to strike a balance between showing some interest 
and not giving her everything she wants. Imagine this scenario. You might engage in conversation with her but not give her your full attention. You might instead tease her or challenge her a little bit. The goal is to keep her on her toes and make her wonder why you're not falling over her like other guys. Don't be predictable. Being predictable is a surefire way to lose a girl's interest. If you're always doing the same thing, saying the same thing, using the same cheesy pickup line, or going to the same places, she'll quickly lose interest in you. You become the herd, meaning you're indistinguishable from the rest. To get a girl's attention, you want her to think, ah, he's not like other guys. Don't make things easy for her. Don't make each day the same. Don't be afraid to mix things up and keep her guessing. Think outside the box, man. This, in the end, is a game. If you're being superficial, odds are she's been tried before by another dude who might now be using the same technique on a different girl and expecting the same results. But truth be told, everyone's different. The world is unpredictable, so why shouldn't you be? Let her know her flaws. Again, might sound counterintuitive, but it's important to let a girl know her flaws. Girls are used to hearing compliments all the time, and while compliments are nice, they don't always leave a lasting impression. But if you can identify something she needs to work on and offer constructive criticism, it will show her that you're paying attention and you're not afraid to speak your mind. Of course, you don't want to be too harsh or critical. That could be a massive turnoff. Be gentle, tactful. Make sure you're offering feedback that will eventually help her improve. For example, if she's always interrupting people when they're talking, you could say something like, I've noticed that you tend to interrupt people a lot. Maybe you could try listening more and letting other people finish their thoughts before jumping in. This will show her that you're paying attention and it'll give her something to work on to become a better person. Allow her to feel left out. If you're struggling to get a girl's attention, then one unconventional approach is to make her feel left out. It might seem counterintuitive, but trust me, it works. One way to do this is by acting nice to everyone around, but intentionally ignoring her. Girls are quick to pick up on these subtle social cues, and if she feels left out, she won't like it. When she sees that you're interacting with everyone around you, but not involving her, she'll start to wonder why. This curiosity can create a powerful desire to seek your attention and approval. Of course, you don't want to overdo it and make her feel just ignored or excluded. The goal is to make her feel just a little bit left out so she starts to crave your attention. This one is uh, tricky, so it's best worth an example. If you're at a party or a social event, make sure to engage with other people and have fun. Laugh and joke with others, but don't go out of your way to talk to her or include her in your conversations. Eventually, she'll start to notice your presence and wonder why you haven't talked to her yet, alone. This curiosity will make her more receptive to your approach when you do finally decide to talk to her. Another way to allow her to feel left out is to mention things in your conversation that exclude her. For instance, you might talk about a hobby or an interest that you have and she doesn't. This will make her feel like she's not in on the conversation and create a desire to learn more about you. Remember, the key is to strike a balance between making her feel left out and not completely ignoring her. You want to create curiosity and desire, not make her feel excluded and unimportant. So, getting a girl's attention requires a certain level of creativity and finesse. By owning a room, allowing her to notice you, making and maintaining eye contact, acting uninterested, stirring jealousy, not being predictable, and letting her know your flaws, you can increase your chances of getting the girl that you want. So don't be afraid to step outside of your comfort zone and try something new. With a little bit of effort and persistence, you can get the girl of your dreams. As the kids say, no cap. I'm also a kid, I just I think, I think that's funny. Okay, bye.